Well, anyway, we may have just founded the club officially, but to remain a club for more than a few days, we'll need some more members. Do either of you know anyone else who might be interested in literature? Um, I don't think of any other friends who'd be interested, no. Not that I want them to know, I really don't have any other friends in general. <laughs> Wait, you have other friends? Shh, of course I do! <laughs> oh, of course! <laughs> I forgot about, uh... uh. Hideo? <laughs> yes, yes, of course! Hideo Kojima? <laughs> From what? <laughs> he, made, he made Metal Gear Solid! <laughs> I didn't know I was friends with Kojima. <laughs> Good old Hideo. I see. And this Hideo, he's not interested in literature, you say? No, he likes building mecha kits and constructing elaborate stories about them, but he doesn't really write anything down. <laughs> Good old Hideo Kojima. I love him. My, my best friend. <laughs> My best friend! You know, you know, me and Hideo Kojima, we go way back! We go way back. <laughs> that's really yeah. weird how- that's really coincidental how huh? I'm playing Phantom Pain right now, too. <laughs> More like it just talks to you about the story for way too long! <laughs> like, Joel's playing Phantom Pain, my god! <laughs> <laughs> that's- this is funny. So, uh, no. I don't know anyone who'd be interested. <laughs> oh! I just thought a friend of mine who would be interested! <laughs> She reads all the time! She's a little hot under the collar sometimes, but I bet she'd be a perfect member. Great, I actually remembered a friend as well. I would have asked her to help fill out these papers that I thought of her earlier. She has excellent handwriting. There's still some time left today. Sayori, you wanna go ask your friend if she's interested? And I'll try to find mine and do the same. You bet! All right, after this, meet up back at the club room. Sayori, it's the empty room on the third floor I was telling you about. Wait, what should I do then? Well, I guess you can help and come with one of us, right? Uh-oh. <laughs> we both still need to actually convince them to join the club, after all. My friend is rather, uh, reserved, I guess you could say. That's the exact opposite of my friend. She's really feisty. I hope two of them get along okay. I'm sure they will, given a little time. Okay, then. Who do you think you'd be able to convince, Zero? Um, well, uh... And that's the end of the demo! <laughs> ah. All right. More to come eventually. The stuff just takes time, you know? <laughs> Understandable? Of course, but now, yeah, it's time to go. Thank you for playing the Doki Doki Rewind slash Replay demo. Hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. All right, now he said open it back up. Yeah. So now if we open the mod back up... When the mod closes, what shows on your screen? It's just like a black screen. It's just a red screen. It's a red, it's like red and black background. Oh, okay. Okay, so now the mod's back up. So now it's booted up again. Oh. Oh. What? Share screen. Oh, right. <laughs> You're just like, wait, wait, Zero, no, I'm not watching the stream. Don't go without me, no. <laughs> Don't worry, Monica. No man left behind. Huh? Wait, why well, am I at school now? I don't remember being at school. How do I... Wait, am I alone? Hello? No response. Okay, um... Wait, what? Wait, what? You're still here? The demo's over. The what is over? <laughs> uh, nothing. Never mind. So, you can probably just go home, Zero. But how did I get here anyway? Uh, this is... This is all a dream? <laughs> um, okay. Does that mean I can do something cool then? Like, you know, control the dream or something? No. Oh. <laughs> So can I at least, so can I do at least something then? Well, <laughs> I suppose that both of you could- Monica coughs, I'm, I'm just kidding, the rest of her said- <laughs> No, excuse me. That I was suppose... a very manly cough, Monica. <laughs> <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> I suppose you, and only you, being the only other person here, with absolutely no possibility of anyone else being here, could use something to do. Let me see here. 
And I goes over in some random direction, seemingly focusing on nothing. Just a moment under breath, and I only just barely hear it. Like she's looking at the co at the fucking the script. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's looking at the she's looking at the command co co fucking console. Can we execute most of the script? Is there anything left over in the files? Ah, okay, found something. Though I must say, you probably won't find this to be the most engaging activity for a dream. Well, it's got to be better than just standing here doing nothing, right? Yes, I suppose so. However, we won't need an audience for this. Hmm. Like I said, nothing again. Although this time appears as though she's deep in thought. Oh, wait, what am I doing? This is a dream. I don't have to give a good explanation for why everyone shows up. They can just be here, and I don't have to expand any effort setting up the scenario. What are you doing? Me? No, what is she doing? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, God! Hey, guys! Don't worry, this is all just a dream. Cool, I love dreams. <laughs> of course it was just a dream. Th that is simultaneously a disappointment and a relief. <laughs> this could have all been avoided if she just said it was a dream. <laughs> nah, but this is fun. <laughs> Anyway, Zero here is going to write a poem for one of us. Wait, that's what I'm doing? Yes. Can't I do something more... interesting? Like a size of rubbing the bridge of her nose. Look, this is all we've got. <laughs> if you quickly write out a poem here, Zero, we can all wake up and get back to what we were doing before this. Oh? In that case, please, I'd love to see you write a poem. Whatever, just hurry up. I'd rather be back where I was than here. Actually, I was arguing with someone. You can take your time. <laughs> All right, fine. I'll just be over here. So I walked over to the desk corner, plops down onto the chair for it. She starts to trace the edge of the desk with her index finger. Uh, don't I need a pen or paper or something? I'm about to write this thing out on the chalkboard. Very quickly turns away and starts filling with a handkerchief. Oh, right, I nearly forgot about that. This may take a minute, so I have to remember where to get a pen and paper. Don't worry about the paper, you can borrow my notebook. Now it seems to be a notebook, I already opened some blank pages. Checking about how quickly she pulled it out, she was already holding it. Actually, this looks a whole lot like a diary. Oh, she was writing your diary. I'm sorry, Fox, I didn't mean for the stream to go on for so long. It's almost done. Stop. I don't care if this is a dream or not. I will kill you if you flipped any other page. Sheesh, I just asked. Thank you for the notebook, Natsuki. Here, practically pirouettes back to face us, holding a pen at arm's length towards me. Here, you may use my pen. She gingerly hands me her pen. Thanks. Well, I guess you're ready then, right, Zero? Yeah, sure. Just let me sit down here. I turn and sit in the nearest desk and stare at the open notebook for a minute, spinning the pen in my hand. Of course, it comes silent as I do. Um... This is really hard. Where do I even start? I rest my head on the palm of one hand, holding my head above the notebook. Start tapping the pen on the desk to no particular rhythm. I can hear someone behind me shuffle from one foot to the other as I do so. As the shuffling stops, my tapping is once again the only noise in the room. Um... I'm trying everything I can think to come up with something. Start tapping the pen on my lips. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> the noise uh -huh. surprises me. We, the Yuri gave us a pen and we tapped it on our lips, <laughs> and she's going. Uh -huh. <laughs> the noise surprises me. Not thinking, I spin my head to look at the girls again. And at the same time, I managed to accidentally shove the pen in the very back of my throat. What? Oh my god! <laughs> Go. Oh, that's not. Oh my god, I can't believe you just did that. Seriously, guys. <laughs> With one deft motion, Monica pulls the penguin back out. Gah! Wasn't stuck there very long, but I still gasp rare anyway. Natsuki, don't just stand there and laugh at him. I know he doesn't have a gag reflex, but he can still suffocate. How do you know about that? It gets lonely in here sometimes. Oh! Um. Oh! 
My face is just like Yuri and Natsuki's. Oh my. <laughs> what does she do? <laughs> I don't think I, I don't think it's safe for me to say what she does in front of the children. <laughs> uh, Monica, that right. Cool. I forgot. I hate if any of you guys I, found I, out that found that out for real. Look, just hurry up and finish your poem. And try not to like start choking on my notebook now too. I don't Fox, understand. You, Fox, you'll you, learn when you're older! Yeah, you'll know when- She's older than me! <laughs> Fox, I'll- I'll tell you when you're ready. <laughs> you're not ready yet, it's lewd. Oh my god. Last thing I- the last thing I need is for you to spit all over that, too. Oh, right, ew. My goal is to pen out further away from her body. <laughs> I forgot this thing was covered in your sp- Monica slowly turns to face Yuri. Oh! She's finally realizing. <laughs> like, oh no, Yuri. I forgot that all of us get lonely sometimes. <laughs> Yuri, may I borrow your handkerchief? Uh, of course, Monica. Yuri chews her handkerchief again and hands it to Monica. Hold them avoid eye contact the entire time. After a few minutes, Monica finishes wiping the pen down and hands it back to me. She then offers the handkerchief back to Yuri. Thank you, Yuri. I love this. This was so worth opening the mod back up. It was. Yuri takes the handkerchief and folds it back up. I turn back to look at the desk in front of me, leaving the pen on the desk this time. None of what just happened has made this any easier. I can almost feel everyone else staring at my back. Wait, I do feel something on my back. A pair of arms wrapped around my shoulders, crossing on my chest. Zero. She's just bring directly into my ear. I can tell you're having a little bit of trouble. Close your eyes for me, please. Uh, okay. <laughs> I can't help but just do what she asks. Now, listen to my voice, okay? I'm sure you'll be able to come up with a poem. You just need to start by writing down some words. Whatever comes to mind. Any words at all, Zero. Once you do that, I'm sure you'll have a poem, poem you can be proud of. She presses herself more firmly into me as she says this. I'll even help you with the words. Uh, alright. I guess I'll just write something down then. Time to write a poem. Yay! Let's make Monica poem. Yeah, Monica poem. If we can. Um. Hmm. Lusty. Oh, that's eerie. No. Oh. <laughs> Game. What? Damn it! What? <laughs> Time. Did you save it. No. What the fuck? I will cheat. <laughs> Fix. Yes. Heart. Uh. No wait. Edit. Yes. Mouse. Wait. That's, why would you think that's her? <laughs> Booleen! <laughs> yeah, that's definitely her. Activate. Player. Variant. Abyss. Oh, damn it. Code. Nope. Uh. Papered. <laughs> Papered. <laughs> oh, work! <laughs> Ink. Epiphany. Co console. Program. Oh, God. Wait. Oh, it tells you! You hover over it and they, and they, they go, oh, oh, oh. Oh, I knew a mod that did that before, but only did it if you hovered over a word once. Wow. Nice to know that I figured this out when we're already done. <laughs> You still got her, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no, I'm just saying. Would've been helpful. <coughs> Alright. Well, I guess that's um, a poem or something. Apparently, apparently really Gas is trying to tell us that we were stupid and didn't look. <laughs> oh, wait, look at the doki at the bottom before you click a word. You dumbass, I said that. <laughs> <laughs> really, Gas, I was in for- I was being- Sorry, Relic Gas. Gas, don't be mean. <laughs> 
Monica unwraps her arms, they hear her step back away from the desk again. Whew! I can breathe again. Oh god, that was scary. What? We like hit zero <laughs> internet for a second. Oh. Luckily the stream's still on. We're almost there, internet, you can do it! Nothing changed on my end, so... I don't oh, okay, I guess it was too fast for it to really matter. I get out my desk and turn around to face the girls again. I'm trying my hardest not to blush. Look at Monica's face. <laughs> Finish with the poem, Zero? Y yeah. Thank you for the help, Monica. It was my pleasure, Zero. Monica chuckles slightly at this. You, you really were right, though. It got a lot easier to make a poem once I just started putting the words down. I don't know how well I did with it, though. It's fine, Zero. I did watch you write your poem, anyway. Just remember, this is all a dream. Mike waves her hand around for emphasis, I think. <laughs> anyway, since you're the only one to write a poem, I'll just pass them around amongst us, and we can all wake up. Mike steps forward and pulls the notebook from my hand before I can react. All right, this poem will most appeal to. Oh my God! There's words for the the words you pick. What the hell? The music is like, what is this tuba? Oh yeah, cause it's like it's like put together. It's sentences for those words that were just. Oh wait, was it an actual poem? I haven't read it. Is this an actual good poem? Hold up. <laughs> no, 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 it's randomly put together based on the words you chose. But, like, could it work? Hold up. Us and okay. Emerald, and after all, we're only lusty game. Me and Time, fix only knows. <laughs> it's not what we would edit to do. Forward the mouse from the booking, <laughs> and the front rank activated. <laughs> the player sat in the abyss on the map, moved from side to code. Oh, wait, hold up, hold up. Hey. Hey, this might be a clean poem. <laughs> when Tara <laughs> says you wrote a fine poem. <laughs> is, it, is, it, is it fill in the blanks? Or is it certain sentences written out based on what you picked? I think this was based on what I picked. Computer was the last word I picked. Wait, y'all did not make... Okay, no. there's Y'all really did not make a, they, each word depending on what I picked. I need no, no, an answer. I think it's fill in the blanks. Please answer for us, one of you two. Wait, cause I could I picked computer last. All the words you picked are in here. What? Yeah, that, that's what I was trying to say. Cause yeah, cause it even top. had abyss. What? And wrote at the very top. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what you picked is in the poem. What? Do that, bro. Does it, is it randomly generate? Like, like not randomly generated, but like, is it <laughs> Natsuki, this music needs to go. <laughs> <laughs> How did they do that? That's so cool. Proof that, like, <laughs> proof that God exists. What? Crap. I knew it wasn't good, but I wasn't expecting to be so upset about it. Zero. That's not the problem. Mom gets out a very long, slow sigh and rubs her forehead. <laughs> I'm still not getting used to having to speak like this. <laughs> I watched his hand, and he did not write a single word other than the ones you chose. Oh, wait, what? Wow. I'm giving an A for effort, Zero. What oh. did she say on the top? I can't really see it. Huh? What did she say on the top? I, can't oh, I was reading it. Though I do have to say, thank you for writing this for me. You're simply the best at clicking random words. <laughs> It seems to give you more personal attention more often. Oh, God! <laughs> Polonatsky! That's crew of House Pie Monica tears notebook out from behind her back. Hey, I was in the middle of something. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure none of us want to see the end of that something, Monica. <laughs> Besides, it's my diary. I don't really care. I need to see what Zero did to... Seriously? Couldn't even bother to get the grammar right? Why still a freaking injury? May I see the poem? Whatever, don't read anything else. Nasi breezes by Yuri, shoving the notebook in her hands. It takes a moment to recompose herself, so she the notebook. Hey, protector. Hey, protector. I think this poem could use a bit of pre proofreading, Zero. <laughs> Yuri plays the notebook on the desk in front of her. Oh, come on, it can't be that bad. She runs over the desk and reads the notebook. 
Well, we all have to start from somewhere, right? <laughs> <laughs> I love the fucking comedy of this mod, I swear. <laughs> I love how they did that. I love how they made the poem based on the words you picked. I love how they do everything in this mod. I love how it's just like, it can't be that bad. And then she reads it. Well, we all have to start from somewhere, right? <laughs> <laughs> there was so much effort put into this. I turn back towards Monica. All right, look. Can I just wake up now or something? You're the only one who even kind of liked my poem. Even knowing that, it was just random words strung together. It feels good to find another poem written for me. Well, I have to give positive reinforcement when I can, right? But to answer your question... Yeah, I suppose we're done here. For now, anyway. It's possible this is the last time you hear from any of, uh, you, you'll, you'll hear from any of us for quite some time. Don't worry, we'll be back. It's just going to take a lot of work. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta make a mod. <laughs> I hope yeah. you, all of you, can be patient with us. She's talking to us, guys. Listen. <laughs> I, I bet. I, how long did this, this alone take? This is two hours. We'll come back as soon as we can. But, for now, hope you enjoyed this. Goodbye. That's nice. That was a nice thing. And now it's done. Okay. Good <sighs> shit. Oh, let's put chill time up. So we can discuss a little about the mod. Oh my god. <sighs> so. Oh god. It's been a great night. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Tubular Encore. If you want to see the rest of the responses, you can just start from the game again, by the way. <laughs> oh, okay, that's good that we can do that. Oh god. So that means there is a reason for you guys to go download it for yourself. Yeah. <laughs> you can get the rest of the... Wing Terra says that you can get the rest of the responses. <laughs> what a toast he said is fucking fucked insane zero this is possibly the most unique ddlc mod yet whoever made this has done a fantastic job so far i can't wait to see the full release especially the monica just ranting mc stupidity without teach for being so dense oof yeah you did join way too late <laughs> indigo yeah we're done <laughs> honestly robbie i couldn't have said it better myself this is honestly one of my favorite fucking mods so far like this is just a fucking demo <laughs> like oh my god imagine the full release i, it, I really want to see it I can't wait for it. Okay, mod creator, you get a 5 out of 10. He does not. He gets a fucking 10 out of 10. Everyone who worked on this, this mod's amazing. Oh, yeah, not a 5. 5 is way too low. <laughs> this mod gets a broken marriage out of 10. <laughs> 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 no, no, this mod is honestly, like, just for the fact that this demo is that good, I on this is now, like, one of my most anticipated mods. I have very high hopes for this. Zero, notice me. Hello, Arish? What, what is it, Arish? Arish254. Hello! <laughs> anyway. <laughs> yeah. Really like this stuff. You you guys over there did some good shit. Yeah. This is a good mod. You know, I'm waiting for in the stream, man, so I can attack you without bodies that are phrases. This mod's amazing. I don't want to wait for the full release. The humor and the coding itself is amazing. I agree, yeah. Fox. It sucks that we have to sit here and wait for the full release, but of course, you can't rush perfection. <laughs> yeah. If anything... Think about it like this. If they, the longer they take on it, the better the outcome will be. Wait, what do you say? Can you please answer Relegas if you could send it to him? I'll send it to you, Relegas. I mean, what? you can just find it on the modding Reddit. It's still there. Just type Doki Doki re Replay. Yeah. <laughs> but honestly, like, I'm just, like, honestly, this is, this shit is like, I just, so good. <laughs> I like how this started out with both of us being like, don't you think we replay? What is this? And then at the end, we're like, wow, that was great! <laughs> it's just very, like, it does, like I said before, while well, I think in the middle, it does emotion very well. Like, the emotional scenes, it does that, like, Monica apologizing, that was done very well. It does a very good job of the, com of the comedy. <laughs> yeah, I feel like, very... like, 80% of the jokes landed. I feel like there's a lot of, like, a lot of things made me laugh in this mod. <laughs> yeah, I was laughing so funny say like everyone acts in character like everyone like there's never really a scene where i'm like monica wouldn't do that or sayori wouldn't do that like they do th like oh, yeah. everyone does oh, yeah. things how i think they would <laughs> everyone is in character perfectly while they're also making jokes 
and also being serious at the same time. It's amazing. Like, I love Sayori. A lot of the jokes seem to be with Sayori, too. Sayori was, like, a hilarious throughout this. Like, Say Sayori just being <laughs> gullible was funny. Like, like, that's good. Like, just, like, the fucking one. Like, there was, like, the one scene where she was, like, where she was trying to not call him a neat again. It was, like, visual novices are people who are neat. I mean, very nice people. And then MC is just, like, Jeez, nice save there, Sayori. I didn't catch on to it. It's like, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> just like, Sayori's just, it's just, it's so good. Honestly, yeah. I really enjoy this mod. Nine out of ten, yeah. just a vanilla hurt me. That was vanilla, yeah. like, a little bit in the See, beginning. See, that's, that that's the funny part. I forgot all about the vanilla in the beginning just because oh, of how dude. good the rest was. But yeah, that's probably my only complaint. <laughs> I mean, just don't, just don't put vanilla in the rest of the mod. <laughs> But I mean, I feel, but the only problem with that was the vanilla had to be there. It's kind of like summer times where the vanilla had to be there to build it up. I'm pretty sure the vanilla was there just to spite you. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, that, that's, why, and that's why I feel like it was in this mod too. The vanilla's there just to make you think, what the fuck is this shit? Oh, so it's like, it yeah, it's like, yeah, it's like, so it feels like it's one of those things where it's like, I would say less vanilla, but like, I feel like that ruins it in a way. <laughs> Cause I feel like it ruins what they're going for. I feel like they're going for that. That's why they have the vanilla. Like as long as you do something with the vanilla dialogue, I'm fine. <laughs> it's just the mods that have vanilla dialogue for literally no reason besides they couldn't think of any other dialogue to put there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then it's an issue. But if you have a reason for it, then it's fine for me. But yeah, uh, very good mod. I'm hungry. My voice hurts. <laughs> I was drinking pop this whole stream, so <laughs> I'm caffeinated and hopped up right uh, now. Yeah, uh, to the creators of the mod who are watching, I hope you enjoyed my playthrough. Uh, if you try, if for, and for the people watching on YouTube, when I cut these into parts and upload them, if you guys want to download this mod for yourself, the link will be in the description down below. And yeah, also another thing I forgot to mention, I love that, I love that they put in the Monica noticing that you're streaming. <laughs> I love that shit. Yeah, Very good. That's good. Love that shit. I'll go back and watch your VOD. I appreciate you doing that, Wing Terra. <laughs> anyway, yeah. That is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Zero. Peace. Bye! Bye.